Hey golfers, Dean with GolfAllYear.com and today's video is about swing speed. I wanted to find out how accurate is the OptiShot swing speed stat. And so I put it to the test against my Swing Caddy 200 uh, launch monitor, which I believe is pretty accurate. And I compared the two. I set the, the Swing Caddy behind the OptiShot, compared the two, and tried to find the results. So let's see how accurate the OptiShot 2 swing speed is. Uh, I hit my irons, I uh, hit a, uh, the pitchy wedge and the five iron. I did not hit my driver as I don't think that my driver records uh, accurate sometimes. And so I wanted to get an accurate reading here. Um, and so understand that I don't have a really fast swing speed. So uh, bear with me there. But overall, I think you'll be surprised with the results. So take a look. All right, you guys, we're going to test out the Swing Caddy S200 swing speed versus the OptiShot 2 swing speed. Uh, going to see how close it is. The OptiShot has been set at uh, the speed adjustment percentage to 100%. Uh, so it's what it, the default is. And um, we'll see how, um, what the difference is between the swing speeds. Okay, we're going to start with the pitching wedge, and then we'll move on to different clubs from there. Sixty-nine swing, swing, swing speed for the swing caddy. Seventy-one for opti shot. One hundred fourteen yards. That was eighty-nine swing speed for the swing caddy. Seventy-one for the opti shot. That one more realistic, 71 for the swing caddy, uh, 69 for the opti shot. All right, that wasn't a very good shot. That was 68 swing speed for the swing caddy, 71 for the opti shot. Seventy one swing caddy and seventy for the opti shot. One hundred seven yards. Seventy nine for the swing caddy and sixty seven for the opti shot. Seventy for the swing caddy, sixty-eight for the opti shot. One hundred ninety-nine yards. That was sixty-four for the swing caddy and sixty-eight for the opti shot. All right, let's try a different club. Let's move up here. Let's move to my five iron. Let's hit the five iron now. Seventy five for the swing caddy, seventy three for the opti shot. One hundred 
155 yards. 76 for the swing caddy. 76 for the opti shot. Seventy-five for the swing caddy, seventy-four for the opti shot. Looking pretty close so far. One hundred fifty-one yards. Seventy-five swing caddy, seventy-seven opti shot. Pretty good shot. That was 81 swing caddy, 76 opti shot. yards. Another really nice shot. That one was really close. And we had a 78. For the swing caddy, 77 for the opti shot. 159 yards. That was right on line, 77 for the swing caddy, 74 for the opti shot. All right, one more. That was 80 for the swing caddy and 74 for the opti shot. All right, so let's look at it and analyze the results. All right, golfers, there's the results. Uh, you can see that the uh, opti shot two swing speed was very similar to the swing caddy swing speed. Uh, there were a couple that were off, but overall the averages were very similar. Uh, in fact, it was one mile an hour less than the swing caddy launch monitor for the pitching wedge and for the five iron. So, uh, you know, if you're using the, the opti shot, I think you're going to feel good about uh, using it to, to be accurate in terms of your swing speed. Uh, remember, it only tracks the club. It's not ball speed. It's just speed, speed, uh, swing speed, uh, club head speed. So uh, understand that. But other than that, I think the OptiShot 2 does a pretty good job of being accurate with its swing speed. All right, golfers, I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, please subscribe to my channel. I'm getting close to uh, my goal, which was 1,000 subscribers, and I'd really like to get there. Uh, you know, that's been my goal uh, since I started this channel. I have well over 100 videos in, on my channel, and, and I'm posting every week. So uh, please subscribe, click the notification button, and let's keep getting better at golf.